What's up guys and welcome to something very, very special. I'm sure a lot of you in the horror community have been keeping an eye on releases that are coming up and Crow Country has been one that has had so much excitement going on um, and just pure expectation with it. Now I have been very, very lucky to get my hands on early access of this game thanks to Neon Hive and the developers at SFB Games, so thank you guys so much. I've played through it and this is my review. Get ready guys, because this is going to be something special. I'm sure many of us will remember the good old days of survival horror, the terror of creeping around tight corridors and wondering just what is going to jump out at you, scavenging resources in the hope to find bullets when you're running low or desperately seeking health when you're on danger status and nothing in your inventory, the thrill of working out a difficult puzzle, the list goes on. Crow Country is all of this and more, it's a love letter to the golden age of survival horror and a pure nostalgia hit. Fans of old school Resident Evil and Silent Hill will love this game and I think horror lovers in general will love it too, whether you've played old school horrors or not. Set in 1990, you play as Mara Forrest who heads to an abandoned theme park to investigate the disappearance of its owner, Edward Crow. Mara can wield a variety of weapons to take down the monsters that stalk the park and is able to find new and even upgrade her firearms as she explores. It's important to search carefully as you go as resources are scattered everywhere. I lost count of the amount of times I found stuff despite visiting rooms over and over again simply because I wasn't looking properly. Puzzles are, of course, an important element in the gameplay, often needing to be solved in order to progress. These really do make you think, and I would highly recommend having a pen and paper nearby. Graphically, this game reminded me a lot of Final Fantasy VII with its blocky character design. The environments, however, give pure Resident Evil vibes. This game is a pure nostalgia hit from start to finish and with a seriously engaging storyline with some incredible plot twists i found it very hard to put down the team at sfb games have created something incredibly special here and should be seriously proud of the and i don't like to use this word often masterpiece that they have made play this game do not sleep on this game you won't be disappointed <laughs> 